Hey guys, good morning. We're here in the studio this morning. I'm here with Alyssa Nolan. She's with Kahuna Tans, and what we're doing today is... I'm getting a spray tan. So what we need to do is we have to get ready first. Now I have on a tank top and basketball shorts, which is perfect, because all I had to do was roll out of bed this morning. So how do we get started off? Okay, well the first thing we're going to do is we're going to add a barrier cream to your hands and nail to protect it from staining. Okay, so... Um, so in case they, they don't turn orange or anything? Or well, not orange, but you know, like they... A stain. The brown? So, yeah. Okay, so... It so. stain, so that's what we do first. And, um, just apply that, make sure it's rubbed in really, really good. Okay, and this isn't the only place that you apply the barrier cream? Correct. Where else? We'll apply it to your hands, your elbows, knees, okay. and feet, and heels. So do I need to take, is it okay to take off the hoodie Absolutely. so that way you can get to my elbows? Probably a good idea to do that. Okay. <laughs> no, I got it. <laughs> I came prepared. <laughs> All right. <laughs> now, uh, I have my flip-flops here because I need to take off my shoes. And I'm looking at this, and Meredith brought these in this morning for the sugar and, um, am I allowed to grab things? Yes, okay. absolutely. Go ahead. Um, this thing is the glowing body scrub. Now, this isn't what you want to work with. Correct. Why is that? The reason being is this has uh, oils in it, and it has probably, I'm not sure whether it has sugar or salt. Preferably, we want to go with just kitchen sugar. Why That's is that? That's what you want to use because there's no oils in it. The oils are... It, acts as a barrier cream mm -hmm. or a barrier and what we're wanting to do is just exfoliate with the sugar that way the tan can be applied and it's just it's going to take okay now when i got in the shower because we had to do this yesterday i had to start off and so that way i didn't get completely you know naked so <laughs> we started off yesterday and we did my chest and my thighs right here and that was so that way I didn't have to get naked. But when I got in the shower last night, I saw it kind of come off. Now, why is that? Now, you know, in case people get this done and they get in the shower, they don't want to think that it's all coming off. Right. It's kind of startling at first, and they think, wow, there goes my tan. That yeah. was but really what happens is it's just uh, the spray where it's been sprayed. But during the time that you waited for the tan to take process, it's actually getting a deeper tan. Okay. And it's actually there, if you noticed. I did. I noticed when I got dressed this morning. Well, right actually, there. I didn't have to get dressed. I just rolled out of bed. But I had another question. Okay. Not only men, or not only women do this, but you right. said a lot of men come in and do this as well. I have a lot of men. It's really growing as far as the men. They're getting a lot more comfortable with the idea. They feel good about being able to come in and be pampered as well. All right, well, I guess it's really good that I'm comfortable in my own skin. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, be sure to keep watching Daybreak. I'm going to get the rest of my barrier cream applied, and then a little bit later on, I'm going to be hopping in the booth to actually get spray tanned. So be sure to keep watching, Meredith and Steve. All right, take it. Thank you. All right, Meredith. <laughs> I went ahead and we went ahead and applied the, the primer, mm -hmm. the barrier cream. Mm -hmm. Now what we're going to do is we're going to apply the primer. So, Alyssa? Let's go ahead and get this started. Now, do I need to get in the booth? Yes, please. Okay. Go ahead and get yeah. in the tent. Yes, please. Yes, please. Now, how did you determine my color? Because well, I know that it's a process, right? It is. Some of the questions that I asked during our consultation were, um, when you tan, you know, do you get a sunburn the following day? Do you have a tanner that's actually burned? And things like that. So... And then also, of course, we went by the color guide here to find out what color you would like to be. Okay. And then it's a combination of different colors that you combine in order to get the color that you that we came up with for you. And hopefully, you've been happy with the color. Yeah, I you think have. I think so far I've been pretty happy with it. Now let's go ahead and start applying this. Okay. Now, how long does it usually take for someone to get fully primed up? Just a matter of a couple of minutes. Okay. Well, so let's go ahead and this start right priming. Here will, it'll be a couple of seconds. So it, it might be a little bit loud. But okay. That's fine. Okay. All right. So here we go. Here we go. Now, Alyssa, what, um, what is the primer used for? It's for coverage. But this primer here has a, um, a lot of conditioners in it. It's all organic. It's natural. It smells good. It smells it's not fine. overbearing. Uh-huh. 
I'll go ahead and get the bottom of your feet. Am I allowed to touch, you know, anything? No. No, no okay, yet. I won't touch. <laughs> it's kind of a workout. You just kind of pull the arms up. Okay. <laughs> Perfect. This is my uh, hint that I use whenever I'm on. Oh, that's fine. Okay. Yeah. That's not good. <laughs> We're good. Okay. All right, now do I need to turn it's around? Turn around. Okay. Oh, it's so cold. <laughs> it is kind of cold. You just kind of spray back here. All right. <laughs> How's that feel? It feels fine. Feeling good? Yeah. So we're good. We're just going to let that set for a minute. I'll get the color and we'll get started with that. Okay. Now, okay. with the color. I'm coming in here because I just want to see what it looks like. Now, I've been through this process before and I think it it's kind of relaxed. Like Jacob and I were talking about it earlier. It's kind of a relaxing experience to, to be in here and to, you know it feels good it feels yeah. nice well she came right? in here and she uh to apply the barrier cream she had to like massage my the hands and the yeah. feet and put everything on to make sure it was deep in there uh -huh. now why do you apply it to such uh to these areas because what happens is these areas here they're lighter the skin is a lot thinner okay so we want to make sure that it's a more of a natural look okay and that's my whole goal is to give each individual person a natural look okay when they leave they're excited while they're there they're being pampered it's all about you so that's the whole deal is just to make it look natural so what would the next step in this be the next step is we're going to go ahead and apply the color. Okay, right. well, let's do that really quickly. Yeah, let's go again. We can go color. and see how this is. Now, I want to... Have you showed the folks at home your kind of before and your My after? before? I know you I put it on Facebook. You, I just want to show you the before and after of this. <laughs> okay. Because it really does. I think it looks really good on guys. And, I thought so. You know, it's show them your line. <laughs> you have to show them the difference between there. what you had and what you got, <laughs> right? So this is what it's going to look like at the end. How can they get, do they have to make a, you know, you're over at Gold's Gym too. So I yes. know if people are a Gold's Gym member, they get some cash off in one of these. And a lot of folks in town are Gold's Gym members they as are. well. So how Absolutely. much roundabout are we looking to pay whenever um, we come actually to Actually, I'm offering everybody an introductory price okay. of $35, which includes the primer. Uh -huh. You don't have to have the primer, but I definitely recommend it because it's just like painting a wall. Okay. When you do that, you have better coverage, even coverage and... I like how you guys it makes said it that so I was like painting nicer. a car. Well, you know. I'm not a Buick. You need it <laughs> so uh, It is. It's kind of, it kind of reminds me of It looks like it process. whenever she's going in there and she's painting a car. So you're I getting do. the color done. And really, all in all, you would say it probably takes maybe about 30, 45 minutes to get this probably, done? Probably, yes. Okay. The whole so, consultation so not a whole lot of time. Kahuna Tans. I'm going to let you put on the color. Okay. And Jacob, you can remind folks how they can get in touch with you. All right. The, Guys, you can wake up with Jacob and come over here. Let's let's, let's <laughs> do this. We'll yep, start let's the start process. This. So we okay. can make sure everybody at home. <laughs> everybody can see what it looks like when you get started. Now, right. am I going to do this? How am I? Like this? If you stand towards closer to me. Right. Remember when we were? Okay. We'll do this a little <laughs> there bit you differently. Go. There okay. we go. Perfect. That's okay if you get it dirty. All right, guys. You guys can wake up with Jacob by finding me on Facebook. Just send me a message, or you can email me at jbrackford at kvii.com. I'd be happy to come out and check out your business or event, or you can also find me on Facebook at Pro7JacobRackford. Bradford. Be sure to Facebook message me or email me. Be sure to keep watching Daybreak. we got a little bit more left in the show. Like this? Just like that. Okay. <laughs>